Yo, 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 what's up? It's your boy, Prospect Boy, coming back at y'all again with another video. Saturday evening here, uh, Southeast Texas. Uh, doing pretty good. Uh, just got through eating and uh, hanging out with my cousins for a little bit. Um, <clears throat> hope all y'all, hope everybody out there is having a good Saturday and uh, enjoying your day also. Um, in today's here video, I want to uh, talk about uh, those good old church people that we know. Um, and then give a little, uh, a little story that happened earlier this week. Uh, last, I think it was last year, uh, I done a video titled, uh, is going to church alone enough to save you? And, uh, some, for some reason the video ended up getting cut off. But anyway, uh, basically in that video I was, you know, calling out, uh, I think one of my uncles that uh goes to church but but uh and, and and you know talks badly about people that that don't really go to church and but he you know isn't just living just you know right his own self but uh anyway uh this is what happened earlier this week uh my uh my great uncle's wife mother passed away and uh, we went to her funeral uh, Monday. It was this past Monday. And uh, you know, at the at the funeral, you know, they have uh, the uh, the time where they they give people, you know, if they have any remarks to make, you know, they can go up there and do that. And um, I didn't know the lady personally. You know, I just went for my uncle, and I went for my my uncle's wife because I'm real, I'm pretty close to her too. You know, I went to support them. And um, <clears throat> my uncle's mother-in-law, one of her one of her grandsons, got up doing the remarks uh, every time you know to speak or whatever. And uh, so he goes up there, and he uh, he had a, a, a piece of paper with him that he had written something down on. So um, he gets up there and he he starts you know uh, talking about this. Uh, 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 Joe Osteen, the pastor. I guess he watched one of his sermons on television, and he was talking about the sermon in his own, and he was relating it to his his grandmother. And um, you know, so yeah, he done that, or whatever. So later on that night, you know, I was posted up with uh, I'm not, gonna, I'm gonna let this person remain nameless, but one of my family members that you know goes to church every Sunday. And um, I don't know how it came up, but the it, it came up about the, the the grandson going up there, you know, making remarks about his grandmother, and uh, she asked me did I, did I understand what he what he was saying and everything, and I told her I did, and um, then it came up about what he was wearing. Now now he he went up there and he had on like a, a t-shirt. Well, not a t-shirt, but, a, you know, a, a, just a regular, you know, shirt and jeans. And uh, it came, you know, it came up about what he was wearing. And I was like, you know, why is that even important? You know, um, you know, this this guy just lost his grandmother, you know, and, and the only thing that these people that that some of these people could come up with to talk about after the funeral was what he was wearing. It's talking about how he shouldn't have, you know, showed up wearing that and all this. And I'm like, at the end of the day, it does not even matter. It does not matter. Like, you know, some of these people that go to church often and, and call themselves religious, you know, they just pass so much judgment on other people. But they don't take the, the, the time to look at their own selves and their own lives. You know, so... It just got me to thinking, you know, I need to I need to do a video and address that. But yeah, you know, I, I I was like, it doesn't matter, you know. Instead of talking about what he was wearing, you know, uh, try to be understanding of the fact that he lost his grandmother. Maybe that was all he had to wear that day. You never know. I mean, uh, a, a lot of these people they treat church 
and, and, and religion and stuff like that like it's like it's a fashion show fashion show you know you don't go there for that you go there to the the praise worship and 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 you know whatever whatever spiritual form that you worship or whatever you go there for that it's not about how you dress or whatever like i don't go to church all the time myself when i do go i just i dress casual you know it doesn't matter and and the church that i go to you know it, they don't care about that either you know but i i know some churches uh i know that there's this one church where the pastor he screens everyone that comes in the church and if you don't if you're a woman and you have on jeans or, or, or pants, or if you're a guy and you're not wearing like a tucked in shirt with a tie or whatever, he will not even let you in. And you know, to me, that's just ridiculous, man. But I mean, I think that, you know, people should be presentable when they do go or whatever, but it's not all about what you're wearing or whatever. But that's all I want to say in this video, man. Um, uh, I want to say rest in peace to uh, my my uh, my great uncle's mother-in-law, uh, and anyone else that's lost anyone recently. You know, rest in peace to them also. And uh, I'm gonna get off of here and uh, get out here and do some walking in a little bit. Walk off some of this food. Uh, hope everybody has a, uh, enjoys the rest of their evening. And uh, tell me what you think. For those of you that see this video, tell me what you think about this. So I'll hit y'all on the next uh, go-round. Y'all take care. Prospect out.